Hello, my name is Sarah Duong, and I'm a project manager and consultant at Concentris. Today, I want to show you how to bulk fulfill sales order in NetSuite. This is a little bit different from your typical CSV upload because uh, fulfilling sales order via CSV does not use the normal CSV import assistant. So let's first look at the UI screen. I'm going to go to transactions. I'm going to go to sales. And then we're going to go to fulfill orders. In this screen, there's an import CSV button. I'm going to click that. OK, as I go through these fields, I'll explain a little bit. But uh, the first thing we want to do is talk about the file. So you're able to click here where it says click here for sample file. And it'll bring up a template like this one. It's very straightforward. It only has a few fields. And under here is directions or instructions for each of the fields. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and upload the file that I'm going to bulk fulfill. Character encoding, you can just keep it at this at the UTF-8. Posting period, you're able to select where you want these item fulfillments to post. We'll keep it at October for now. You're also able to select the date of the transaction, the status of the fulfillment record. So I'm going to choose shipped and the location where you're going to bulk fulfill from. Okay. You also have the ability to choose ship via. It can default from the order on the sales order or on the transfer order, or you can uh, select one here manually. I'm going to go ahead and choose default from order. Down here, you can also add and set certain criteria or certain values for the fields. So what's different here is that in these fields, let's say, let's pick memo here. And I'm going to put Hello, testing. This message in the memo field will show up for all the item fulfillments in your file. All right, so before I click submit, I'm going to show you that my two sales orders that I'm going to bulk fulfill are currently in pending fulfillment. This one's also in pending fulfillment. Okay, and now I'm going to hit submit. It's going to take me to a status page. OK, now the refresh has been completed. This uh, item fulfillments have been completed here. I'm going to go back to the sales order now. And I'm going to refresh the page. And now you see it going into pending billing. I want to show you the item fulfillment record. So under related records, I'm going to click the item fulfillment. Here you see that it's in the ship status. And in the memo, it has the memo we typed in, which is hello testing. Okay. So that is how you bulk fulfill using a CSV import. Thank you for watching, and if you have any questions, feel free to reach out to Concentris. Thank you.